Most of my constituents are sick of paying higher taxes and getting service that isn't always the best from government at all levels. The debate playing out in the House chamber rivaled the intensity of the crowd outside. We did listen to those public safety forces. You know, I hope there's no school groups here, Mr. Speaker, trying to, trying to take a tour because the rudeness of the loudness of people who... Uh, <laughs> With union supporters looking on from the gallery, the House floor arguments were passionate. Democrats criticized recent changes to Senate Bill 5 that further restrict how unions collect dues and fees. What does this do to create jobs? Nothing. How much money will this save state or local governments? Not one penny. Republicans pushed back, calling Senate Bill 5 a pathway for job retention. We can save the jobs of probably thousands of public employees through Senate Bill 5 by streamlining operations, reducing costs, keeping the best, helping them work more efficiently. Asked about the bill, Governor Kasich would only reiterate his often repeated rationale. My greatest interest in this bill was giving local governments, local governmental entities, including schools, the ability to manage their costs. And that's precisely what this is doing. Democrats dismissed Kasich's remarks as cover for a politically driven agenda to weaken unions. Kasich had the chance to weigh in further, but chose to stay silent. I don't have any more to say about SB5 today.